This is a Black Hill Spruce Picea Glauca Densaya. Purchased at Lowe's two years ago. And actually there's been some die-off of the needles inside and lower. I cut off the lower branches down here to try to slow the spread. And I'm not sure what it is. It doesn't appear to be something like Rhizosphera needle cast. This is growing in Middle Tennessee. It could just be a combination of the heat and humidity. Of course it's outside of its range. And uh, you can see it's kind of hollow on the inside. But the upper needles are doing good. It didn't put on quite as much growth last year as it did the year before. Could also be environmental stress. And it was shaded before some trees that were shading it got cut down. So I'm going to wait and see what it does next spring. And hopefully cutting out the bottom branches will increase airflow and reduce fungal growth. You can't see it, but there's some Cetomelanoma holby fruiting bodies on the inside branches, little black dots. Yeah, it shows up a little. You can see small black dots there. But that shouldn't be a problem from what I've read. As long as it doesn't get stigmina needle cast or rhizosphere needle cast, should be okay.